Hello! Sorry guys, you have to uh, flip your phone <laughs> around because I, I think it's just better to uh, show you the house in a horizontal way um, and apparently Instagram Live doesn't do it so I cannot rotate uh, to... yeah but nonetheless, today, happy Saturday everyone and hope everyone is doing well um, we have just picked up keys to our latest investment property it's in a new investment area and we are really excited to um, get started with this project this uh, buying process took almost six months and actually um, we purchased it through the modern method of auction and it was supposed to uh, to complete in like say like two months three months but uh, we were struggling to get uh, inquiries response from the seller side so from the seller side there was a lot of delay for at least a, a good few months and then right at the end our lenders solicitor also came up with all sorts of um, random stuff that oh we need one more document here we need another document here so it is a, a bit of a nightmare but glad that everything is sorted at the end and we completed yesterday today we came to pick up keys and i'm just going to show you around so it's currently a four bed no i think it's a three yeah three bed um, and terrace property and right now i'm just standing at the entrance it's looking like that oh actually i can turn the camera around so yeah so this is the entrance and the electrics so one thing you need to remember is always take the meter readings when you first get the keys first thing you do take the meter readings so you can set up your account and um, yeah the electrics it's very old so we eventually have to replace it this is the entrance where i'm standing and this is the front reception room we will turn this into a bedroom with ensuite and that's another reception room which is really huge we are either going to turn this into a kitchen diner or a bedroom so um, Marcus is just over there um, taking measurements right now so then with exact more exact um, measurements we can decide uh, whether this room will be turned into a bedroom or so bedroom with ensuite or a kitchen diner so which one makes sense um, and also the, this is the old kitchen and the previous previous owner they have extended it so this was where i think the old house ended and they extended it so this whole part is yeah an extension and you can see it like this and we have a lovely back garden everything is overgrown we have a lovely tree there as well so all these would need to go um, and because we are in terrace so actually we have a lot of uh, we we have a, a little pathway on the side and we have a side window so that's great so yeah probably the shed needs to go as well and maybe right over there we are going to put in uh, an entry gate just to have a bit of privacy for our tenants so oh uh, i probably haven't mentioned i haven't uh, probably haven't mentioned what we're gonna turn this into this um would be turned into a six bed hopefully all on suite uh hmo and uh yeah it will be rented out to um working professionals and well the the next alternative is actually um perhaps uh, getting a social housing contract on it so we can help the council house uh, council tenants or um supported living assisted living or we can do it as a flip as well so there are so many exits to this property and yeah we're just gonna uh, first do some measurements and 
uh, get in touch with relevant people so and s decide on what we want to do with it most likely is going to be a six pay HMO for uh, working tenants yeah so right now I'm just gonna bring you upstairs this way upstairs and to the right this is another huge bedroom so this would obviously be one bedroom and then the ensuite could go into this corner this is how it looks it has two lovely big windows and this way um so all the way to the end this is a, a bathroom right and a good size bedroom with a little bit of a storage down here so what we are going to do here is actually um, this is a staircase to upstairs which I will show you later so uh, we are going to bring the entrance of this bedroom forward up till here and this will create a bigger bedroom with ensuite so then let's go upstairs so upstairs the the thing that sold us on this property is actually this attic conversion this loft has been yeah boarded and you know they have heating here they have electrics here so it is um i think it was used as a bedroom and it's huge so uh, what we're thinking of doing to it is uh lifting the roof up here bring it uh, further back and then building a dormer so that we can create two bedrooms in here so it's it's huge i can show you <laughs> the size of it i'm a bit out of breath but yeah that's the plan uh there is still a little bit of furniture in in the house and actually the previous owner she was arranging for like a charity to come and collect the furniture so for example this this cabinet is gonna go um this dining set is gonna go like they're fully functioning so um before this we didn't know that it was possible to get a, a charity shop to actually come in to uh, take all this furniture away so it's maybe a tip there for for some of you who are doing projects like this um yeah if you need some furniture uh, removal charity shops they don't charge uh, it's free collection so if you want to get you know fully functioning uh, furniture removed then get in touch with them so yeah that is um that is how the property looks like and yeah thank you guys for watching and this a video should go up onto our youtube channel as well lc and marcus uh, you will find it in the link in our bio and uh, yeah see you guys on the next one and stay tuned for more updates bye